to Ready Steady Clog. I'm Clog. And I'm Chris. And today we're going to be making chilli chocolate cupcakes. Let's get started. Chris, do you want to tell me the ingredients? Yes, I will. 150 grams of clay flour. Bosh. 160 grams of cocoa powder. Half a tablespoon of baking powder. Half a tablespoon of ground cinnamon. One tablespoon of mild chilli powder. 150 grams of unsalted butter. 200 grams of caster sugar. Two tablespoons of vanilla extract. Two large eggs. Be careful. And 125 grams of milk. Oh, milliliters, my, my bad. 55 grams of dark chocolate to decorate. Right, let's get cracked. Thanks, Chris. First, we have to sift the, together the flour, the cocoa powder, the baking powder, the cinnamon, the chilli powder, and a quarter teaspoon of salt. Salt? Salt? No, it's said salt. salt. <laughs> <laughs> okay, carry on. Put the butter and sugar into a separate bowl and whisk until pale and fluffy. Right, okay, we're getting ahead of ourselves here. Let's get a bowl. Right, so how much flour do we need? 150 grams. 15? 115 grams. We should... Uh, oh. Right, that'll be enough. <laughs> 121, that'll do. <laughs> Chuck it in the bowl. In the bowl. Bosh. You get it all over already. The first instruction. <laughs> it's going to be a messy one, this one. <laughs> Cocoa powder. How much? 53, 58... Right, 64, 64, too much. Well, no, because we put in too much flour as well. Baking powder. And that's one? Yeah, that's one. Right, that's done. What next? Oh, God, I've got to read through this again. Cinnamon, cinnamon. How much? Need half a tablespoon of ground cinnamon. How much? Right, oh, don't want to make it too spicy. And a quarter of a teaspoon of salt. What about chilli powder? Oh, yeah, we need chilli powder. Chilli powder. Can't get the stuff. So I'll put in a bit more. We'll just give it to people we don't like. Ed. Ed. <laughs> Enjoy. <laughs> so, quarter of a teaspoon. How do you measure quarter of a teaspoon? It's silly, isn't it? I have no idea. And sift it all together. <laughs> <laughs> Apparently, sift means to put through a sieve. And we didn't put it through a sieve. Who would have guessed that? We're going to pour this into this bowl. <laughs> and then sim it back into that bowl. Here's Tom attempting to get all that mixture into this little <laughs> using bowl. Just a teaspoon. <laughs> using just a teaspoon. Oh god, this isn't gonna go well. Will it fit? Will it fit? Of course it's gonna fit. It might not. What have we could we put too much flour in? There we go. Right. Job done. Now we're gonna sieve it. Here's Tom sifting it. It means sieve, so why not just write sieve? It's like fancy bakery talk. Can I do cloggy shuffle sieve? Yeah. <laughs> Vanilla extract first. Two tablespoons. This lid's all sticky on this. It's horrible. I mean, this is Madagascar vanilla. Does that make a difference? Right, there's one. What? <laughs> Madagascar vanilla? It says Madagascar vanilla. Does that like, like, mean it tastes of lemurs or something? Yes. Oh god, I've lost where we are. Oh no, we haven't put the butter and the sugar into a separate bowl and whisk until pale and fluffy. Next, we need to put the butter and the sugar into a separate bowl and whisk until fluffy. Chris is going to whisk. I have no idea how to whisk. Oh god, I'm getting sugar over it. I really should have found those electric whisks. Max, do you know how to whisk? Oh, no. Thanks for your help. Here's Tom attempting to whisk. Oh, it's doing the same as it did to you. Here's Tom failing to whisk. I found an electric whisk. Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> so. Is it working? 
Even it's getting glued to. What's this second one? Even the electric one's <laughs> failed. A whisk that doesn't whisk. <laughs> what is going on? It's a big and powerful machine. It's going to use need to use two hands to <laughs> use that. It's not, it's not even working. Whoa. Um, we think we managed to whisk it. Job well done on me things. Well, not well done, but it's done. Now we need to add. Two eggs, one at a time, and whisk after each addition. One egg. Whisk again. Uh, oh, it looks like a right mess. So look, people are going to eat this. Ed. Right, you ready for the next one? Around the edges. Look at all that hanging around the edges. I'm sure it walks off the key. Number two, egg. Crack it on the side. Fingers in. Fail. <laughs> you can just watch me all day if you want. Of course, I'm the extended version. On the outtakes of Ready Steady Clog After Dark. <laughs> right, I think this is about done. I think it's about done. Show yeah. the camera. There it is. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because they're definitely going to buy them now. <laughs> says, add half of the flour mixture and the milk and whisk until incorporated. <laughs> Mystery incorporated. <laughs> add to a scooby doo. Pierce through one door and out the other. Whoa. No mistakes have been made so far. Don't shoot, bad man. <laughs> Sorry, Georgina. Mix until incorporated. Whisk until incorporated. Cue Scooby-Doo theme. Scooby-Dooby-Doo. <laughs> Where are you? I need some help from you now. Scooby-Dooby-Doo. Where are you? We got some work to do now. Ooh. Here's Chris, having a whisk. It doesn't look very nice at all. For all you ladies at home, here's Tom at work, putting a bit of muscle behind that whisking. Aww. Oh, someone's going to eat that. <laughs> Washing my thumb. Come to the Lovelace Theatre Group fundraiser, where you can lick Tom's thumb. Tom Thumb! <laughs> the next step is to put this into these. Now we've used different colours. We were going to colour code them so we knew which ones were the chilli cupcakes and which ones were the chocolate cupcakes. But there's no fun in that, is there? No. So, <laughs> there you go. Right, I'm going to lick this whisk and see if it's the mixture's spicy. Pow chicka wow, pow chicka wow, pow chicka wow. Do, 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 do. <laughs> it's a little bit spicy. I've been really trying, baby. Trying to hold back and feel it. Alright, you can stop now. Chris is going to spoon the mixture into the cupcake cases. It's going to be a messy job, but someone's got to do it. Are all spooned out. You've been a bit messy there, Chris. I mean, look at this one. It's not my fault. Right, come on, in the oven. In the oven. Make sure you get a parent to do this bit. So, they're done then, Chris. Yep. They look good, don't they? They definitely do. Now it's onto the icing, I think. Let's get started. We need 115 grams of butter. 123. Right, that'll do. Whisk with an electric whisk. We're not, we're not going down that road again. Just whisk. Uh, whisk until pale and fluffy. Add 185 grams of the icing sugar. We should have done this in a bigger bowl. <sighs> now he says. I'll pretend it's electric. 
this is what I have to work with. This is what I have to work with. I've got butter on me t-shirt, butter on me t-shirt, butter on me t-shirt, what am I gonna do? Do you want an apron? Might need somewhere. I'm just decorating the side of this bowl, inside of this bowl we just bought it. Why is it it's not whisking? How could it be white and fluffy? Butter's yellow. <laughs> <laughs> Concentration. Concentration, kids. Consecration. Oh, look. Smile. <laughs> Fists. Straight arms. Whisk together until well combined. They use some funny way, funny <laughs> expressions in this thing. We're using the tidiest bowl. Look at this. Golly, that's a big one. So we've mixed it all in. And now we're putting it in, well, it's missing. We're putting it into the icing tube thing. Right, we're gonna start putting it onto the cakes. Yep. This one? Go for it. When we're doing swirl? Uh, whatever you want to, Chris. I hope these turn out all right. Right, let's do the rest of them. Uh, <laughs> we've done our best. And this is what we've ended up with. What do you think, Chris? Um, yeah, they look good. <laughs> so, the next part of the recipe is going to be really fun. We've got to grate some dark chocolate on top. Yeah. Here's Tom with a cheese grater and some chocolate. Tom, what are you doing? I'm going to grate some chocolate. Come on, audience, come and get your cakes. And there you have it. Done. We made some mould cakes that didn't have chilli in so that we can do a chilli roulette. Uh, so some cakes will be nicer than others, maybe. Although I think the chilli ones are pretty nice, don't you? They are pretty nice, yes. And we're going to do a tasting in a moment. So, I hope you enjoyed this video. Stick around for the tasting. Just uh, one question, Tom. What? what are these quake cakes for? Well, Chris, I'm glad you mentioned that. They're for the junior fundraiser on the 19th of July. The 19th of July? Oh, yes, this Sunday. This Sunday? Yeah, at the John Gopher Centre in Hucknall. Well, I think I might go to that. Well, you better be there for half twelve, because that's the time it starts. We've cut them up. so. We can't tell which one's which. So... Do you want to go first and see if you get a chilli one? Uh, I'm going to go for this one just here and hope for the best. Okay. Talk us through what does it taste like. It tastes really nice. Does it have the kick of the chilli? I don't think so. Tom's turn to try one. Which one will he pick? Oh, uh, I'll go for this one. He's gonna go for that one. Did it, did it, did it, did it. Did it, did it. Oh, his face is going a bit red. Is it chilly? I think I've got a chilly one. <laughs> oh, he's got a chilly one. Oh, <laughs> he's got sweat on his brow. So we've got a chilli one and a non-chilli one left. Chris was lucky last time. Which we one's he going to get? Which one are you going for, Chris? I'm going to go for this one. Ooh, drum roll. Ooh, it's a 50-50 chance. <laughs> you all right? His eyes are watering a bit. <laughs> I think I've got a chilly one. <laughs> Good luck with this at the fundraiser on Sunday, folks. It's quite nice, but there's a bit of kick to it. <laughs> Finally, the last one. I wonder, hopefully this one, well, this one shouldn't be chilly. If it is, I'd be very surprised. Oh, look. He's put, a, nice, this one. he's put a smile on his face. 
So there you go, you've seen us make the cakes, and now I think it's time for just one last thing. I know what you're thinking. The Cloggy Shuffle. Let's do it! Cloggy. 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 Hashtag I'm a clogger.